pay. Today, we are going to learn how you can start using Return Prime to handle returns and exchanges. In this video, we will be creating a test order on Shopify and raising an exchange request. Let's go. The first thing you need to do is open your Shopify dashboard. Once you are in click on Orders, on the left sidebar. Here on the top right corner, you will see a button, Create Order, click on this button. Now please select one customer and product here. You can create a new customer with your own details. Once everything is selected then click on Collect Payment and then mark it as paid. You have successfully created an order, now you will have to fulfill this order to test the return slash exchange process. Please click on the Fulfill Item button and on the next screen you will see the Fulfill Item button on the right side. That's it now, you can use this order to test the return slash exchange process. Now click on Apps in the left sidebar and then launch the Return Prime app from there. Here click on the settings and then open General Settings. Here you will see an option to preview your return page, click on this button and it will take you to the return page of your website. Now you can use the test order details to raise a return slash exchange request. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any kind of questions, issues during the process, feel free to drop an email to us at help at returnprime.com or make use of the live chat option available on your return prime dashboard and we promise to ensure everything is up and running for you instantly.